Kareem Hilton reporting live from the Makeup Artist Summit. Here in downtown New York City, we're here at the Metropolitan Pavilion, and as you can see, it looks almost like an American Idol audition line, but no. <laughs> These ladies and gentlemen are here for something much greater than that. They're the ones that turn the stars into stars and make them shine. They're here for both days, I assume, maybe, maybe today, maybe tomorrow, some for both. As I said, they're going to get the latest in makeup techniques get a head start on grabbing some of the latest in products as well, introduce themselves to other professional makeup artists, do a little bit of networking, and hey, make sure you stay tuned right here with MUA TV. The Artist Summit, downtown New York City, it's going down, it's a two-day event, there's no other place that you would want to be if you don't believe me. Check out all the people piling in through the doors, and we haven't even officially opened just yet, so I decided to get a jump on the gun and sit down with these two gals. Well, actually, we're going to stand up for this one, because... <laughs> It's, it's worthy of standing up. Allison Raphael, is that, am I pronouncing that right? You said it right. Hey, you know, I got a tricky name, so I, I'm used to getting everything butchered, so I wanted to make sure I got that it right. right. It's important. Well, tell us a little bit about your line here. Tell us a little bit about my, about my line. I've had my line since 2000, and then I recently um, revamped the whole line this past February to be makeup artist developed but eco friendly. Okay. So all the products are paraben free, talc free, fragrance free, mineral oil free, and gluten free, uh, but they do hold up to HD standards, and uh, we make <laughs> We base we, we keep the line is very condensed. We make the we make the real essentials of a makeup artist kit. Uh, we make the foundations of your kit, which is basically primers, foundations, concealers, and powders. The uh, the, the concealers just won best concealer of the year on Glam.com, which was really exciting. Hmm. And uh, a lot of the products are also enriched with antioxidants, so they're good for you and they look great on. Now, if everything is free, how do you stay in business? No. <laughs> <laughs> You know, your clients, they want stuff they know that you're putting on them that's not going to hurt them. Right. And this stuff is all really safe to use. It's it's safe for, for a post-procedure as well, so we sell to a lot of dermatologists and estheticians okay. as well. Okay. And, uh, you know, it's all made to professional standards. So. so as long as people are looking for green, that keeps the green coming for you then, yeah, right? Yeah, that's exactly I right. get it. I get it. <laughs> now, maybe if I'm a little bit low on green today, what's the one thing that you would recommend that I take one with me? One thing that's really fabulous is our primer. Okay. And everything is, hand me your hand. Oh, <laughs> everything man. today is 40% uh, off, or pretty much 40% off. Okay. And the primer is SPF 15. It also has, but it's, uh, it is, um, Mineral based SPF 15. It also has our Frita de Vita antioxidant complex. It also has peptides in it. Hmm. Uh, this it, either anti aging or uh, anti acne. And then, of course, it's your primer as well. Oh, wow. Yep. All of that for 40% off? <laughs> yeah. Give me two. <laughs> what kind of customer we like. Yeah. All righty. Thank you so much. Thank you. Now, you're, are you Allison? I'm Allison. This is Allison right here, AllisonRaphael.com. Yep. What are some other things we can find on your website? What else you can you find on my website? You can find out all about how peptides work. You can find out all about our Fruta De Vita antioxidant complex. Okay. And you know what? I've got a great, great link called Ask Allison. So if you ever have a question, you can email me and I answer my emails personally. I don't have my computer with me right now, but I do have one question. One can question. I ask you, Allison? Yes, you can. Where'd you find your crime partner? Oh, <laughs> Amanda Corvine, my partner in crime yes. for today. She, uh, her, I, her brother works with the creative agency that okay. did our packaging. So, how long have you guys been working together? Today is the first day. Oh wow! <laughs> yeah. Look what I've started. Yes. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Perfect union. Yes. You guys are gonna be here for both days then. Be here yes. both days, and I'm speaking at noon both days. Today it's Ingredients 101. Tomorrow I'm speaking on uh, 25 tips for the eco-friendly artist. We will be there at 11:59. Excellent. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. This is shiny, shiny mama. Shiny mama for a shiny mama. Come on over here, shiny Woo! mama. <laughs> shiny mama is a cosmetics brand that emulates opulence, decadence, and debauchery. Ooh. And we have shimmers, we have glitters, and they're multi-purpose. And my new product is a double-ended multi-purpose pencil. It's a shimmer. Here, try it. Thank you. 
So could you repeat those three things that it, it... Opulence, decadence, decadence, opulence, debauchery, actually, DOD. Okay, okay. I used to develop products for Tony and Tina Cosmetics, and I've been uh, open a year since okay. uh, I celebrated a year anniversary in June. Fantastic, and congratulations. Release. Yes, thank you. And uh, everything is done by me, no investors, so I'm releasing products little by little. You know? Okay. So just trying to make the world sparkle. Well, MUA TV Makeup Artist Television has a lot of viewers that were probably interested in, in something like yourself. No, oh, you see, th there, there it goes. Sorry, um, I partied like a rock star last night. <laughs> so um, I'm just setting up, and um, I'm not ready for my close-up, but I will be in about two seconds. <laughs> Once again. That's her opinion, right? Uh, there you I, go. I think she's ready for the close-up. Well, I think you guys you. both are, huh? Thank you. How did you come up with the name Shiny Mama? Oh, well, Mama? Shiny Mama was the name, uh, it's my nickname, and it's uh, a name of my rock band. And um, so I said, you know what? It's just a natural progression. Let's, okay. Let's name the brand Shiny Mama. Absolutely. everybody knows me as that. Okay. Cool. Well, we appreciate you taking some well, time out with us. Well, rock on. Okay. <laughs> well, can you introduce yourself? I'm Theo Kogan from Armor Beauty. Okay, and your partner in crime here? I'm Jamie Clayton. All right, and you ladies look like you're you're ready to go for the two-day event, huh? Oh yeah, are totally. You, are you based in New York or? Actually, the company's based in LA. Okay. Um, my partner's Allison Burns, and we started the company there. But I live here, so we have the both both coast uh, covered. Yeah, you know, exactly. Cool, cool. So, is this the first time that you've been doing this event here in New York, yes. or? Yes. What prompted you guys to get set up and ready to go here for well, this weekend? Um, we went to the makeup show and loved it and think the powder group's amazing and the mm -hmm. magazine's amazing and so it was an absolute honor to be able to be a part of this event, especially for a new line debuting. Right, right. How long have you guys been out so far? Um, we, we launched in yeah, March. Oh, wow. Yeah. So it's literally brand new, it's huh? Literally brand new. What prompted you to want to link up with these guys? I mean, they're, they're just getting off the ground. You're, you know. I've been friends with Theo for a really, really long time, okay. and I completely believe in the product. It's amazing. Okay. So yeah, I was honored to help her with the event. <laughs> yeah. A lot of honor and a lot of armor going on exactly. here this morning. <laughs> well, we appreciate you ladies taking some time to, to spend with us. If there was one thing that that we absolutely had to have from Armor Beauty, what would it be? I say I'm tight on my budget today, but I could, I could put one thing in my bag from your booth. What would it be? Well, I would say we're on, you know we're doing a special price for today, so it's only twelve dollars. Okay. So if you had to buy one thing, I would buy the Femme Fatale gloss, which is our black lip gloss. Black lip gloss. Yes, which is very very now. Okay. Yeah. Little and Rihanna going on there. Well, everything. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen her rock that in some videos, right? Mm -hmm. Cool, black lip gloss, guys, from Armor Beauty. Only $12 for the event, so, hey, you have your perks for waking up early on a Sunday morning, I'd say. Yeah. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you. Uh -huh. Pencil me in. They are here, and we're about to get things going. What is is that a little bit of breakfast you have here, trying to beat the rush? Yes, it is. Thank you for <laughs> noticing. I see you have your booth set up here, and, boy, I tell you, for those of you guys at home that need something a little bit extra to get you over that hump, this is definitely one of the booths that you'll want to stop by. Tell us about your products that you have here. These are um, Pencil Me and Eyeliner Pencils. There's vitamins and antioxidants in the formula. Okay. And we built a sharpener into every pencil cap, so you have the convenience of a sharpener. Cool. There are 30 eyeliner pencil colors. Um, six of them have a subtle glitter in them. And all of the colors are tweaked to be a little bit different than the colors that are normally on the mar in the marketplace. Um, there's all kinds of vitamins and aloe vera and all kinds of extracts, so it's a healthy eyeliner pencil. All so right. when you're actually applying the pencil, you're getting a benefit. Okay, okay. It feels like I, like I'm a kid again, like the big giant crayon box yes, with all the different absolutely. colors and whatnot, but only with the vitamins, okay, guys, to give it an extra healthier feel to it. Exactly. Now, whose idea was that to, to add the, the extras? You mentioned the subtle glitter in there as well. I mean... I've been a private labeling cosmetic pencils for other companies. Okay. for many years. So I took the best of the best in the formulation. I knew there was a need to have um, a nutrient that actually can absorb into the eye area okay. added to the pencils. So um, it was my idea and it was my husband's idea to put the sharpener cap on the end of the pencil. 
he's the me and pencil me in. All like right, I like it, I like it. <laughs> See, you know what, whenever you do use a pencil, that's always the one thing you forget about. You know, you're like, where's the sharpener? When you, there you, you don't lose it, it stays right on the end. Absolutely, know? absolutely. So are you guys excited about this weekend's event? It's, it's going to be fabulous. It's our third show working with the Powder Group. Okay. And it's uh, our first time doing an actual seminar. So we're very excited about that. We hired, um, we're working with uh, Spring Super. Okay. She's going to be doing the seminar for us. and. Uh, I haven't met her yet, and I'm very excited, so it's going to be a great day. Well, maybe when she shows up, we'll grab you guys in the collaboration so we can get it all on tape for those of us watching MUA like TV. All right, well, we thank you guys for joining us. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. Maybe this isn't such a great place to stand, but we want you to experience it as if you were here yourselves, so you'll make sure to be here next year, okay? We're live at the Metropolitan Pavilion at the Artist Summit, all right? And we're broadcasting live for you, so that way you can see exactly what goes on. If you were here, yeah, you would be crammed in too. There would be people saying, excuse me, pardon me. What is it that made you get up this morning and, and, and come from Vermont? And come from Vermont. We thought we came a long way from California. Vermont. But we were on a plane though, so it's a little right. bit different. You were probably in the car longer than we were in the plane. Ice on the windshield though this morning. Ain't oh. happening in California. Ice on that windshield. Ice on the windshield. She still got up in order to make it here. How long have you been doing makeup, James? Uh, I used to model years ago in Italy, and so you know it's like bike riding. It's something you know, and now I'm using it. She used I'm to model all... years ago. I go. bet you could probably still do a little bit of modeling every now and then. Uh, uh, I just like working with women. Now. Okay, okay, sounds good. You're gonna pick up a few products today, then? I think I'm on. All righty. Well, thank you for joining us. You know you're dealing with royalty when the word crown is involved. It's Kareem Hilton reporting live from the Metropolitan Pavilion at the Artist Summit, and I'm here standing in front of the Crown Brush booth. They are flying off the racks. My friend here is on the cell phone, at, taking orders too, right? Yes. You're buying up a couple extras? Of course. For my colleagues, they need something, so I'm grabbing it for them. <laughs> she actually was in line 15, 20 minutes early before the doors even opened up, and this was the first booth that she got to, Definitely. Crown Brush. I, 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 you know what? I was doing okay, but now I'm doing much better. I see that you brought me breakfast. I did. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, no, no, no. You're too kind. You're too kind. Actually, one or two crown brushes would be just fine. Why don't you explain to the viewing audience why your brushes are different than everyone else's? They're the best because I said so. No. Uh, basically what it is, we it's different componentries that we use that make it a better brush. All of our handles come from reforestation programs. Okay. So afterwards, uh, we actually the only brush company that has a recycle, uh, recycle program. Oh, okay. So you can turn in your old brushes and we actually break them back down and recycle them to different areas. Uh, we use, um, I would say, the finest materials from synthetics all the way down to every type of natural hair and they are 100% uh, animal cruelty free. Cool, cool. Yeah. Now aside from the brushes, what are some of the other products that you will have here? Let's say, let's say I I got brushes at the last convention sure. and I want to pick up something else from you guys. What's the one item that Always I would take with me? Only something new. Our brand new shimmer palettes, which okay. are just a great buy in general. I mean, the retail, they're about $100 and we sell them to professionals only, of course, for $20. Uh, top of the line brush cleaner, it disinfects your brushes and cleans them within a couple a couple seconds. So 10 seconds at the most, you can have a clean brush again and it dries quickly. Okay. Uh, and then just basically all of our wonderful products. I mean, we have new sets every month. We have stuff coming out all the time. So, Now, what is the website where we can find out everything that you guys have? www.crownbrush.com There you have it. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Uh -huh. Have a good day. Boy, I tell you, you can never pass up anything free. And I'm here in front of the brush guard booth and they're actually giving out free samples. Now, it looks like I could probably take Oh, you think? You're not implying anything by giving me this, right? I'm good to go? Maybe? No strings attached. No strings attached. 
Introduce yourself. I'm Diane Baker. Oh, hold on, Diane. I'm going to just put this here real quick. Pleasure to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. And what is it that prompted you to show up to the event? Well, I'm out here from Seattle, and Baker and Plant is introducing a new product in the cosmetics market. Okay. It's called the Brush Guard. It's a brand new product. It's a patented device that has never been seen before. It's only available through us. Wow. And it is a flexible tubing that fits over your brush. Our uh, package has six per package, four different sizes. Ranges from teeny to immense. And when you have the right brush cover in place, you can store your brush without any worries at all on your roll, in your kit, in hmm. your gym bag, in your bathroom when you're traveling. I throw my brushes in my suitcase. I come out the other side. They're perfect. And after you wash your brush, you can also slip the brush guard over. It's completely uh, open to the air. And you can dry it bristle down and you don't end up with that brush droop that people get. Wow. And it also keeps the water away from wicking back into the ferrule where it will degrade the attachment to the brush handle. So your brushes will last longer. You'll save a lot of money. Yeah. You'll be able to afford better quality brushes and more brushes because you're going to be so happy with your ability to take care of them. Yeah, how long has the brush guard been available? Oh, just a few months. It's brand new. We huh. just brought it to the market. Okay. And it's available on our website, which is called thebrushguard.com. T-H-E-B-R-U-S-H-G-U-A-R-D.com. And we have a show special, $5. Oh, that wow. includes New York tax. Okay, okay. It's five fifty on the website. That includes tax and shipping. <laughs> now, was this your idea? Or? I am one of the co-inventors, and my partner Malcolm Plant is the other. We hold a patent, and our patent is um, good for the United States and most of the rest of the world. That is really, really cool. Thank you very much. And we appreciate you coming out here all the way from Seattle. Absolutely. We've had Vermont today. New York is Florida. a treat. It is, and you're going to stay for the whole weekend, I'm gonna right? I'm going to be here for the whole weekend, and I just love I, the only bad thing about the show is that I'm not able to be out in the gorgeous weather and enjoying the city but I'm really happy to be here well you know this is the city that never sleeps so you can get some time a little bit later on sure <laughs> <laughs> well thank you so much thank you uh -huh. Standing in front of the 9x9 nine nine booth, yeah. the powder group, I'm standing here with James, a.k.a. Jam Master J. They've been in line for your products, just so you know. They're sending emails all over the place. They're saying this is the place to get them. The Artist Summit, downtown New York City. What is it about the 9x9 nine nine that has everybody going crazy? Well, 9x9 nine nine is a new program. It's a new product line that we're actually launching at the Artist Summit. And 9x9 nine nine is something that was the brainstorm of Michael DeVellis, who actually is the owner and and creator of the Powder Group and okay. the creator of the Artist Summit. And what 9x9 nine nine was, was a way for him to work with other makeup artists to develop color stories and products that were timely and timeless okay. um, and definitely showed the individual creativity and artistic vision of each artist. So what we did with 9x9, nine nine, because 9x9 nine nine is such a positive number, and 9x9 nine nine are also the measurements for our magazine on Makeup Magazine, oh, okay. we worked with nine makeup artists to create nine product collections that were based on their inspiration and kind of where they saw makeup going. These are the first four and I'm really excited to show you the color stories. Greg Hubbard, who is actually the lead artist for the Powder Group in New York, um, amazing makeup artist. He was Bobby Brown's personal assistant. He's now gone on to do other things, a lot of television and editorial. Cool. He created a collection that really works with um, the basics and, and beautiful skin for women of all colors. His collection was actually inspired by the beach and, and seashells and nature. The next collection is Kate Best. Kate Best is um, probably best known right now. She's the makeup artist on Ugly Betty. So oh, okay. she does America Ferrera. Um, she does um, Vanessa Williams. She's been working with Vanessa Williams for years. And her inspiration was really color. She wanted to work with those grays and browns and neutrals that work on all skin tones, oh. all skin types. And what she really did was she added in a pop of color. And I think that's something that's really great for makeup artists to think about or real women. When you take a neutral palette or you take a natural palette, and you put a pop of color in, that's when you start to develop a makeup that becomes your signature application. Okay. So many makeup artists start off and they do the same cookie cutter application on each person. What these makeup artists have done, what we've done as makeup artists is we've started to develop our own style. Ah. And that's what people start to recognize you for. 
Johnny Leboy um, is probably one of the most well-known makeup artists working today. He's also a hair artist. He's with Ford Artists here, and he's been with the Powder Group since the beginning. Johnny created a color collection that's all about brights and texture. Hmm. He created a pure pigment collection and a polish collection that works with bright greens and fuchsias and blues, and really takes that pop of color and takes it to the next level. The nice thing about the color and the pure pigment is you can use this on the eyes, lips, and cheeks. So you can really go in and create something that's basic, everyday, natural makeup, or you can really push the envelope and create something that's a little more avant-garde. Hmm. The last collection is my collection. Um, my work is primarily right now editorial work. I do a lot of runway and red carpet. I work with a lot of celebrities, but I'm very reference oriented. Okay. And my reference for my 9x9 collection was the movie Barbarella. Um, Jane Fonda, controversial or not, is one of, to me, one of the most iconic feminist, uh, beautiful women working today. Mm -hmm. Everything from Playboy magazine to Hanoi Jane, she's done it all. And what I wanted to do was create a color collection that was inspired by her iconic role in Barbarella. Okay. So I worked with metallics like bronzes and golds and, and patina shades to really bring out the beauty of the skin. Whether it's a light skin tone or a dark skin tone, you can sheer on the color, you can build it up. Everything in the collection is multifunction. And what Michael wanted to do when he thought about 9 by 9 was really work to create products that were multifunction. Because when we look at artistry, when we look at what we want to do with the Artist Summit or with the makeup show, we really want to break makeup down to its most basic. It's all just color to us. Right, you right. Know? And we wanted to give people a palette that they could really go in and create something really amazing with and, and develop their own style. Cool. Now you mentioned that you work with a lot of celebrities. Do you remember the first celebrity that you worked with that made you say, oh my the God, I can't believe the celebrity that I ever worked with, um, I actually worked for LaFace Music in Atlanta, Georgia okay. when I was just out of college, and my first celebrity was Pebbles. Wow! Um, yeah, who was married to the boss at LaFace, right. so it was a really important gig. <laughs> And um, working with Pebbles led me to a lot of other artists at LaFace, and uh, I was still behind the makeup counter at the time, and through Pebbles, I met Gladys Knight, okay. and I worked with Gladys Knight, and through Gladys Knight, I met Coretta Scott King, Cool. and from there, my um, celebrity list just kind of grew, so, so I, Pebbles was my first. So I think we know who you're rooting for to win Dancing with the Stars then, huh? Yeah, I think you know. <laughs> I think you know. Appreciate uh, it. Although I do love Cloris Leachman, too. All Is righty. she still on? Did she make it? I don't know. We've been here. So we gotta we gotta stay tuned tomorrow, right? I I don't I guess <laughs> I don't know. Thanks, I'll James. check it out. Thank you. <laughs>